Hey everybody, in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to upload a PDF document to ChatGPT using the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin. Right before I would show you the process of uploading a PDF and summarizing that PDF document with the ChatGPT code interpreter plugin, I just want to let you know that I have a full tutorial on this ChatGPT plugin where you can learn about some of the use cases and some of the best prompts you can use this plugin with. And you can also get access to a complete database of all currently available ChatGPT plugins that can be installed from the ChatGPT plugin store. You can search this plugin database by category, plugin name, description, and get quick access to ChatGPT plugin video tutorials, the best use cases and prompts for all available ChatGPT plugins. The database can be downloaded for free, but you can also support the maintenance and the frequent updates of the database with a small donation. Any support is appreciated. You can get access to this database by using the link in the description below. But now let's see an example on how to upload the PDF document or file to ChatGPT using the code interpreter plugin. So as you might know, there are also plugins that you can use to upload PDFs, but code interpreter is another way to upload PDF documents to ChatGPT. If you're interested in these plugins that you can use to upload PDFs, I will, I will also add the link to those videos in the description below. So for instance, there is the Ask Your PDF plugin, the Chat with PDF plugin, and there are multiple plugins that you can use. But now let's see how to use the code interpreter plugin. So first, of course, you have to make sure that the code interpreter plugin is enabled in your account. And you can do that by clicking on settings and then selecting beta features and make sure that code interpreter is turned on. And to be able to use the code interpreter plugin, of course, you have to have a ChatGPT Plus subscription. Then all we have to do is click on new chat, then select GPT-4 from the model selector, and select code interpreter. And as you can see, here is the plus icon where we're gonna be able to upload our PDF document. So all we have to do is add a simple prompt related to the PDF. So let's say we want to summarize this PDF document, then click on upload file, then select the PDF file we want to upload. And as you can see, the file is being uploaded. This is the name of the file. Let me show how this PDF looks like. So this is the PDF document that I have uploaded. It's uh, basically an ebook about the best YouTube tools you can use for growing your YouTube channel. It's about TubeBuddy, Canva, and other YouTube tools. So once the PDF file is uploaded, all you have to do is click on send message here. And if the code interpreter plugin is enabled, ChatGPT will know that it has to use the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin to parse this PDF document and get the main points from this PDF document. And if you click on this down arrow, here's what it has done. So as you can see, it has used a Python library, PyPDF2, to be able to read this PDF file. So this is what it has done. And as you can see, it will give us a short summary of this PDF document, and it will list out the key points made in the document as well. So all in all, this is how to upload a PDF document to ChatGPT using the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin. One thing you have to keep in mind that yes, you can upload and summarize PDF documents with the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin, but based on my testing, this is not the best option to use for ChatGPT. So for instance, the code interpreter plugin will not really work for some PDF documents. I know, don't know why, but I have tried for this Bitcoin PDF document here, which is the Bitcoin white paper. And for some reason it failed to read that document that it was not able to summarize that PDF document. So if you are struggling to get meaningful output from code interpreter, I would highly recommend to check out some other ChatGPT plugins that can be used for uploading and summarizing PDF files. But if you want to learn more about other ChatGPT plugins or the code interpreter ChatGPT plugin, I have a ton of tutorials on my YouTube channel that you can check out and more are coming up, so make sure to subscribe. And also, if you want to get access to the complete ChatGPT plugin database that includes categories, searchable descriptions, and more, you can also find the link to that in the video description below.